The walk starts at Goring and Streetley Station. Now on the first footpath of the walk, there are great views back to the Goring Gap. And further views to my right. And that's the way ahead, beside the hedge. Heading towards Great Chalk Ward. Now on a path through Great Chalk Wood. Now heading uphill along a bridleway, still through Great Chalk Wood. I've now just crossed the B471 and I'm about to take this footpath. That's the way ahead. Now heading through another marvellous Chilton Wood, Great Oaks Wood, heading towards another road, the B4526. Now leaving the B4526 along this bridleway. That's the way ahead. Now heading along the Bridleway sign to Exlade Street through Oaken Wood. I've now crossed a lane and I'm heading through Common Wood along another Bridleway. By the way, I hope you've noticed what a glorious day it is weather-wise. The walk turns right here to head towards Bensgrove Wood. Just look at this magnificent Chiltern woodland. I think this is still common wood. That's the way ahead. Now on the path through Bensgrove Wood, heading back towards the B4526 road. Back at the B4526, the walk now takes this bridle way. That's the way ahead. Further along that bridle way, now heading through Hoare Hill Wood. Approaching Nunny Green, there is more magnificent woodland. That's the way ahead along that muddy bridle way. Now at the path junction at Nunny Green. The walk leaves Nunny Green by this footpath. That's the way ahead, through the gate. The path heads through Nunny Wood. That's the way ahead. Emerging from Nunny Wood, some reasonable views open up. That's the way ahead. Further on, the walk follows this path which has marvellous vistas ahead over the Thames Valley. Just before Maple Durham, which is derived from the Saxon ma Maple Durham, which means homestead by the maple tree, the walk takes this bride away off to the right. As you can see, it's part of the Chilton Way extension. That's the way ahead. Further along the Bridleway, there are great views over to the River Thames. And that's the way ahead. The walk turns right up this track. On its climb, the track passes this dramatic chalk pit. And that's the way ahead. The walk comes to Path Hill. After Path Hill, the walk follows this path towards Whitchurch Hill. Now at the village green at Whitchurch Hill, this is looking back the way I've just come across. The walk leads 
Whitchurch Hill by this concrete track, by these signs. That's the way ahead. I'll off still along the Chilton Way extension. Now heading towards Whitchurch on Thames along this path. Further along, the path runs along the edge of Stonycroft Plantation. The walk passes Whitchurch War Memorial. Now crossing the River Thames on the toll bridge between Whitchurch and Pangbourne. And now at Pangbourne Station and the end of today's walk.